The Uttar Pradesh State Law Commission has released the first draft of the bill aimed at population control and has sought public opinion by July 19th. The bill has called for incentives for those who have two children or less. In case of non-adherence to the two-child norm, there will be disincentives. The act shall be called the Uttar Pradesh Population Control, Stabilization and Welfare Act 2021 and it will extend to the whole of Uttar Pradesh. As per the draft bill, violators of the two-child norm will be debarred from taking benefits of the government schemes and their ration cards would be limited to four units. They will also be barred from contesting local body elections, applying for government jobs or promotions if they are public servants. At least 138 of the 151 COVID-19 samples sent by Tripura for genome sequencing have tested positive for the Delta Plus variant. State Health Surveillance Officer Dr. Deep Kumar Debarma said, Tripura thus is the first state in the Northeast to have recorded a case of the Delta Plus variant. The state government has thus announced a total weekend curfew in 13 urban local bodies, in addition to the ongoing partial day and night curfew to curb the spread of the disease. The new COVID restrictions will come into force from 12pm on Saturday and will remain till 6am on Monday. Union External Affairs Minister S. Jay Shankar said on Friday, the international travel on the basis of coronavirus testing is good enough even as some countries have introduced the requirement for vaccination and called for the need to reach an understanding. People who are tested before for international travel and tested on arrival is a good enough basis for travel, but some countries have now introduced the issue of vaccination, he said, while addressing a joint press conference after meeting his Russian counterpart, Sergei Lavrov. Days after the government created a new ministry to strengthen the cooperative movement, opposition leaders have questioned the setting up of the Ministry of Cooperation, with those from Congress calling it a political mischief and the left terming it an assault on federalism since cooperative is a state subject. The Congress leaders allege that the real aim of the ruling BJP is to gain control of cooperatives in Maharashtra and Gujarat. United States President Joe Biden on Friday nominated Los Angeles Mayor Eric Garcetti as his ambassador to India. If confirmed by the Senate, Garcetti, 50 years old, would replace Kenneth Jester, who served as India's ambassador to the US during the Trump administration. Earlier this week, Jester was appointed as Distinguished Fellow at the Council of Foreign Relations. <laughs> 